Oh, hello there again. I'm sitting in school reading one of my most favourite books. It's called Titus's Troublesome Tooth, and it's written by Linda Jennings and Gwyneth Williamson. And there's Titus with his troublesome tooth. Titus's troublesome tooth. Titus the goat ate everything. He ate carrots and cabbages. He ate dandelions and daisies. He ate prickly, tickly thistles. And he even ate Farmer Harry's trousers and vests off the washing line. Titus absolutely loved eating. Until one day, he woke up with a terrible pain. He didn't want his breakfast and he didn't want to munch and crunch the apples in the orchard. He wasn't even tempted to nibble at Mrs. Harris's, Mrs. Harris's nightgown. Titus felt as miserable, well, as miserable as a goat with toothache. He was a very grouchy, grumbly goat indeed. That's a troublesome tooth, said Danny the donkey. Open your mouth and I'll pull it out with my big strong teeth. Titus shook his horns to the tip of his tail. Uh, no thanks, he bleated. He ran and ran and grouched and grumbled. Until he reached the farmyard. That's a troublesome tooth, said Sadie the hen. Open your mouth and I'll peck it out with my nice sharp beak. Titus quivered on all four hooves. Uh, no thanks, he cried. Titus ran and ran and grouched and grumbled. Until he reached the barn. That's a troublesome tooth, said Polly the cat. Open your mouth and I'll scratch it out with my long shiny claws. Titus trembled from his white beard to his furry bottom. Uh, no thanks, he shouted. Titus ran and ran and grouched and grumbled until he reached the meadow. That's a troublesome tooth, said Basil the bull. Open your mouth and I'll butt it out with my hard curly horns. Titus's teeth chattered and rattled. Uh, no thanks, he sobbed. Titus ran and ran and grouched and grumbled until he reached the duck pond. That's a troublesome tooth, said Daphne the duck. Open your mouth and I'll tuck it out with some duckweed. Titus shook so much that he nearly fell into the water. Uh, no thanks, he yelled. Titus ran and ran and grouched and grumbled until he found himself right back in the farmyard again. Don't worry, said Sadie the hen. Farmer Harry will get rid of that troublesome tooth for you because he's called the vet. The vet! shouted Titus. He quivered and he shivered, he trembled and he shook. His teeth rattled and chattered. No way do I want the vet! Titus ran and ran and grouched and grumbled until Titus bashed his head against the fence and the troublesome tooth fell out at last. And there he is with his troublesome tooth. The end.